Happy Hump Day, YNR fans. We are back with another video, back with another recap. It is also Hump Day Wednesday, as well as the 1st of November. We begin a new month talking about YNR drama. First, Victor tells Nate that he'll fire Victoria and Adam for scheming against him. Chelsea is back, and Billy has a confrontation with Kyle. Welcome back to CBS Soap Dish Recap, where we recap everything CBS Soaps, both the young and the restless and the bold and the beautiful this is your young and the restless recap for november 1st and without any further ado let's talk about this episode this episode starts off with a surprise appearance with Chelsea back in the park where Billy is moping. Now, their reunion is passionate and even better than their video chats. Now, Chelsea's back in town to address some issues at Marchetti involving Cuckoo Chloe and Summer. Chelsea and Billy then head the Crimson Lights to catch up. Chelsea shares the good news about Connor doing well at school and Billy applauds her for being an incredible mom. They're both delighted that Chelsea will be spending more time in town and things get a little bit heated as they relax in bed together. Now in bed, Billy fills Chelsea in on the chaos over at Jabot thanks to Tucker. He mentions Tucker McCall's recent actions and how his sister Ashley has a plan to figure out what Tucker is up to. Now they're unsure of Tucker's true intention, but Ashley is his weakness. Billy's major concern is now Kyle and that he is after his job. Well, now we're over at Society where Kyle confides and Mariah about his job search. They also discuss Mariah's baby and the news of the baby's hearing loss. Mariah advises him, look, to be optimistic and question why he wants his old job back when Billy already holds it. Kyle hints that he believes Billy's job may be in jeopardy. Now, he's determined to take action before his uncle can disrupt things further. Mariah, though, is concerned about the family conflict that might arise from this, but Kyle thinks his career is worth the risk. Mariah leaves Billy comes in, comes over to Kyle. Kyle is like, hey, Billy, what's going on? And Billy is like, look, we're about to have it man to man right now. So now over at Jabot, Summer and Chloe's working relationship is taking a hit. They are arguing over the company's direction, and Chloe believes that Summer is power hungry and reluctant to let go. Now, Summer insists that her concerns are solely about the company's success and not personal power. Now, when Chelsea arrives to the office, Chloe is thrilled to see her and immediately spilled the beans about their problems with Summer. They're desperate to find a way to make Summer see that they know what's best for the company. We have a morning afterglow as after their passionate night, Adam and Sally discuss their feelings. Now, Adam is concerned that their encounter might not mean the same to Sally as it does to him. However, she reassures him that she doesn't regret any of it. Can we mention that Adam said that they spent the whole night being up? and we all know what that means. They could have at least showed it to the fans. They gave us four days of Thomas and Hope. They could have gave us the hours of the night with Adam and Sally. Now, over at Newman, Victor's children confront him over the ruse about his health. Now, Nick and Victoria question his intentions and ask if he truly believed that they'll go through such lengths for a job title. Now, Victor pretends and gaslights to be baffled, accusing them of trying to make him believe that he's losing his mind. Now, Victor continued to act confused and accuses his children of undermining his authority. Now, he dismisses their concerns and claims that he, meaning Nate, is the only one that he can trust. Adam walked downstairs at the GCAC and crossed paths with his siblings, and Nick was like, yeah, you were at Sally's room. It's over. She don't want you. Nick, only if you knew what was going on all night long. Anyway, he shares his concerns about Victor's mental state and suggests a meeting with the specialist, but Victoria was upset that he went and talked to the specialist without him, and then at the same time, they refused to involve him in the situation. After Adam leaves, Victoria and Nick have a conversation saying it's only two things that could be going on with Victor. Number one, he is losing his mind and he don't want to admit it, or he's actually playing a game and is testing Victoria. Now, Victor, he goes to the part with Nick 
28, expressing moments of confusion and feeling alone. He believes that his children are trying to take everything from him. Nate reassures him that his children would never betray him and insist on sorting things out. Now, Victor decides that he's going to fire Adam and Victoria for being a threat to his empire. He's determined to take action against them. However, this is also a test for Nate as well, unbeknownst to Nate. Finally, Adam is old Red Newman. He tries to reach his father, but he wasn't available. He calls Dr. Skelton to arrange a meeting for drinks with Victor later. So yeah, it looked like Adam is on the up and up. He is really concerned about Victor. His siblings are trying to ice him out of this situation, trying to set a trap for him. And Nate, yeah, unfortunately, you are also under suspicion by Victor as well. So there you have it, your Young and the Restless recap for Wednesday, November 1st, 2023. Stay tuned for the Bold and the Beautiful recap also for today. And until the next video, like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Bye.